Hello guys, today I'm going to show you what you can do if your NDI isn't working on your Streamlabs OBS. So while you're streaming and it doesn't work or it doesn't allow you to have it or if it just gives you like a black screen, I'm going to show you what you can do about it. Real simple. So first of all, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and go to your settings. On here, what you can try out first off is you can log out and log back in. Sometimes your account glitches out and that's basically maybe the reason. If that's not working out, if you log back in, it still gives you the same thing. What you can do is you can just close it off and you want to go to the search bar. So let me show you guys. Let's make this a bit bigger like this. You want to go to your search bar and you want to search up your settings. All settings, just open it up. And then you want to go to your network and internet settings. On here, you want to go over to Windows Firewall. And now you want to go over to Allow an App through Firewall. On here, click on Change Settings. And now it will be just in alphabetic order or something like that. So it's really easy to find actually. So let's just go ahead and go to Streamlabs OBS. Once you find it, it's right over here. I already have it uh, set up. So what you want to do is you want to get this marked over here. And you want to also mark this one, the private and the public. So what will this do? It will actually allow the application to... Uh, be running on firewall and stuff like that so it's allowed actually and you can just click on ok and now what you can do is just restart your streamlabs obs and see if it works out so let's just say it still doesn't work out it still gives you a black stream with ndi and stuff like that what you also can try out is you want to right click and you want to go over to run as administrator and just try it like this. If it still doesn't work out, go to your settings, go to general and go to delete cache and restart. So warning, you will lose all of your encounter settings. So it will only just get rid of all of your settings, guys. It will just get back to default settings, but your scenes and sources will just remain. So don't worry about your scenes or sources getting deleted out of Streamlabs OBS, you won't get bleed, guys, it will still save up. So once you try that, guys, you can just try it really easily and see if it works out. But most likely, guys, once you try the one that I showed you with the firewall, it will work out for you guys, really simple. So this was basically the video, guys. I hope you fix your problem. It's quite easy to fix, actually, by, by going through firewall. Most likely, guys, that's the reason why it's giving you that error. And yeah, you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I will leave a link in the description down below. And you can follow, I mean, subscribe and like. That will really help me out, like I said, guys. And maybe join my Discord server. So take care, guys, and goodbye. If you still have questions, leave them in the comments down below. If it worked out, also leave that. I wonder if it worked out for you. If it didn't, also.